Let's talk about what's new this morning. With recent movies being filmed in Sacramento, it seems like the capital city's finally getting the attention of the film world. That's because a local movie festival is making big strides this morning. It joined a group of other film festivals from around the country. Who else is better to talk to about this than our Marcus Allen? He joins us now live from Midtown. You're a big movie buff. You have another one standing right next to you. <laughs> talk to us about this growing movie scene in our area. Yeah, I really want to support what this guy does. Uh, I'm a big movie buff, like you said. I love watching movies. I love making movies. And I love when Sacramento is celebrated and people are lifted up. Kier Stowes, how are you? Good, good, man. Nice, nice to finally uh, be able to do this with you. Yeah, likewise. Great to talk to you on ABC 10. Um, he's the president of the Sacktown Film Festival. And what's great about this, one, it's less than two weeks away, so you need to get your tickets. We'll tell you how in a moment. In the meantime, it's celebrating specifically Sacramento's that is films that are homegrown. And by that, I'm not talking about amateur films I'm talking about professional films absolutely. ready for global rollout that are homegrown that's absolutely correct you got it yeah so these are uh, these are uh, great films that are right here in Sacramento and some of the surrounding areas as well and I'm really excited for audiences to check these films out and see what see what Sacramento has to offer and also given an opportunity for people who otherwise might not have a chance lifting people up let's talk about this first film what are we looking at uh, so the first film that we're gonna be looking at is called Lego my soul uh -huh. uh, it's a it's a horror comedy about a demonic toaster sounds really cheesy but it's a great film we're back at it so a demonic toaster <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, you had me at that I, I've never seen I've seen them all, but I've never seen a film with the demonic toaster. Yeah. So I also want to meet the people who are bringing that to life. Uh, sure. Written by and directed by and all crewed up locally, right? Yeah, absolutely. All right here in Sacramento. Sweet. And the next movie? And then the next movie is going to be Hidden Above, which is a straight horror film, uh, also directed by an individual. Uh, he's actually out of Martina, so mm -hmm. a little bit further out, but still in Northern California as well. So, But a lot of his cast and crew are right here in Sacramento. Awesome. And these are both examples of feature films, but you probably, like most film festivals, mix it up. Do you have short films as well? Yeah, so we have short films, we have feature films, we have a feature documentary uh, about skateboarding here, uh, right here in Sacramento in the 1970s, which I'm really excited for people to see. Oh, that's uh, huge. Yeah, for sure. It's going to be like the pioneers of skateboarding. Really, a little bit for everybody yeah. and also shown on a big screen the way you need to see movies done really well and it's rare that you get to see shorts on a big screen so that's a great opportunity yeah too. you know and that's kind of why i wanted to do at the imax uh because it's really rare to see short films uh featured on the imax screen and it's really exciting and we've gotten a lot of buzz just from people in the community very excited to see their films on the screen for for all for everybody in sacramento to see so. that's awesome it's less than two weeks away i'm gonna link all the information to the sacktown film fest to abc10.com also follow me on facebook it's mark s allen show Let Less than two weeks away, there are still tickets available, whether you want to pop in for a minute or the whole weekend? Yeah, absolutely. So we have a couple different options. So you can either come for like a one block if you just want to check out a few films. You can purchase a day pass or you can go VIP and come all weekend uh, for two days of full films. Awesome. So. Hey, great to hang out with you on this Monday, Mr. President. <laughs> Speaking of cinema with this beautiful <laughs> shot as the sun bounces off of our skyline. Back to you. Ah, Sacramento, so beautiful. So Mark, before you go, is there a certain film besides the ones that we mentioned that is just a must see that he says we cannot miss? So yeah, you've curated all the films. Is there a must see? Like you mentioned a couple titles. Do you have a favorite or is it like picking your favorite child? Yeah, it's really hard because they're all so different and diverse. Uh, but I really do like uh, In Men. That's the skateboarding documentary. That's a really, really good one. And there's a horror film called You're On Your Own Kid, which is really, really cool. Has a really interesting twist for a short. That's awesome. Uh, yeah, I can't wait. I like. I didn't know anything about that skateboarding film. So right now, I can't wait to see that one because my great-great-grandfather skated in the 70s. And yeah. by that, I mean me, <laughs> not trying to sound old. Back to you. I guess, yeah, your great-great-grandfather. I was like, that would have been a pretty cool skateboarder back then. <laughs> All right, Mark, thanks so much. Writing down those titles so we can go see them. We'll talk to you.